question for you. How long before a woman is raped or attacked with the intent to rape her, how long before that incident is it morally acceptable to take away that woman's means of defending herself? If, for example, a woman was in an alley and uh, was about to get raped by a group of guys and, and she had a pistol in her hand and, and pulled it out and was getting ready to, to threaten the guys with it and tell them to leave or she would shoot them or if she needed to actually shoot them. If she had that gun in her hand and you happened to go whizzing by on your bicycle, would it be morally acceptable for you to reach out, grab the pistol out of her hand and keep riding on out of there and not offer her any other good immediate solution for defending herself? Is that acceptable? Um, if you had seen her walking into the alley and had walked up to her and uh, taken her gun away from her by force uh, or threatening her that you'll you'll kidnap her or something if she doesn't, if you took the gun away from her at that point, would that be morally acceptable? Would it be morally acceptable if a week before or a month before you saw the lady and took her gun away from her then? Would it have been okay if it was a year or more before for you to take the gun away? I think that we can all agree that if you came riding up on your bicycle in the alley and took the gun, you'd be a pretty bad person for taking away her means of, of best defense uh, at that moment, right as she was about to be raped. If, on the other hand, you took it away two years in advance, some people don't have a problem with you disarming this woman who ended up being the victim of a rape. That doesn't seem to make much sense, does it? What are your thoughts? If there's enough time between does that make it okay to disarm women? Or does the time not really matter?